Today, we decide who our next president of the United States is going to be. And that cat is going to be Thunderpaw. He will unite our nation with his hair, with his fabulous hair. Aw, I was hoping she'd pick me, DJ Nibbles. I picked you last time, I still love you. Rough around the edges, he's a tiger, a shark. He's a tiger shark in a pool of piranhas. I, I think those two are just kind of counterintuitive, really. Uh, Lizzie, get, get edumacated. That doesn't even make sense, exactly, it doesn't even fucking make sense. It's like the YouTube comment section decided to run for president. Jesus Christ, we, we're not even five minutes into this game and we're already getting fucking savage. You're going up against a bird? Cool. I mean, cool. <laughs> oh, fuck you, sir. Meow Slot the Third. That was a horrible joke and you should feel bad about yourself. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to offend you. In that case, I accept it. You fool! The first rule of politics is never apologize for anything. Apologizing shows weakness. And nobody will vote for a weakling as a president. What's the second rule? No voting for independence. <laughs> oh man, we're, we're not even fucking ten minutes in this game. It's already gotten me twice. <laughs> hey oh, Thundy, is this a manager you were planning to hire? Or are you looking for a new fiancé? Oh shit, we're going to the love story portion. Another word for you. Home equity loan. Do you know what that is? No, I, I, I don't, Banders. Just shut up. We need to find a way to make the home equity loans more equitable. That's what I'm saying in my next speech. Oh my god. Me? I'm a perfectly normal cat. I mean, sure, I sometimes get arrested for attacking furniture stores, but there's a good reason for that. Furniture stores have vacuum cleaners. I hate vacuum cleaners. Only three are having primaries? I thought they had primaries in every state. They used to have primaries everywhere until politicians decided that the other 47 states don't really count in political elections. You know, because they voted the exact same way in every election for the past 30 years. Hey, how, how come you get this big chair where I'm stuck in the back with banders? Because I'm more important than you. It's just as simple as that, Sir Meowzalot the Third. Have you never heard of a rich man? I'm important. Fuck you, Thunderpaw. I'm important. I'm a valued member of this campaign. You've only been on the campaign for like two days. Calm yourself. Calm yourself, child. You're the random... Hey, I got... I actually got the fucking day right. <laughs> How do you make a country great? Simple. Get rid of all the losers who are bringing the country down. Repeal the tax laws, which protect crybabies from paying their fair share. Defeat the gridlock in Washington, which prevents any work from getting done. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to bring a plastic bag with me on the first day to work because I've got a lot of trash to pick up. I'm going to fire anyone who tells me that's impossible or that's immoral out of a cannon. I'm going to, you know you're on a plane and not giving a speech to a crowd, right? You should apologize for wasting my time with pointless questions about honesty and ethics. God, what is wrong with you, Sir Meowzalot III? We were supposed to be near the top floor, but now we were in a large cardboard box in the basement. Meanwhile, Thunderpaw was in the penthouse suite by himself. I got the message he was sending me, loud and clear. Oh man, I love this, I love this, this interior decoration. Like, look at that. Look at those walls, they're so colorful. I love it. I love this home. That's it. I'm just gonna complain for a long time and insult everyone who's working for the government. This is what I do best. What will you do to make the government better? I don't know. Stuff. Things. Whatever the president does. Meet with foreign leaders, maybe. Please, Thunderpaw. I know you've had a bad experience with Oreo, but that doesn't mean... Rip Sir Meowzalot the Third. He, she just got fucking bitch slapped. Jesus. It's time for us to give the country back to the plumbers, the physicians, the photographers, and other jobs that start with the letter P. Really? Fucking really? Do I... Do I really even, uh... Do I have to say anything about this? Thunderpaw's the greatest! Banders is a loser! Are you high on catnip right now, Banders? <laughs> he got mad and left. That means I won the debate. I'm almost as good as debating as Thunderpaw! Stop calling me an idiot, you bitch. 
Then stop being stupid. I shook my head as Thunderpaw's rant continued. Why is he so mean to his opponents? He's going to make them cry and then they'll be sad because you don't ever want to see a cat cry. And to top off this victory sandwich, I just got an official endorsement from Grouchy Cat, the internet celebrity. Yeah, let's go with the memes. Maybe he did. Maybe he didn't. Consider this. What if it's not just Frisky? What if there was a vote splitters in all the key battleground states? Why? I would just be able to cakewalk my way to victory. Yes, see? Yeah. I'm gonna tweedle my mustache now because... Yes, yes. Secret Project Friss. As in Frisky? Oh, what a coincidence. I didn't notice that my secret plan had a similar name to Frisky. <laughs> brings all the boys to the yard and they're like it's better than yours darn right it's better than yours i can teach you but i'd have to charge a 15 dollar minimum wage no just just no just no absolutely not get out get the fuck out right now literally anyone else in the country would be a better president than the people who are running I, I, I get it. It's, that's a reference. I get it. And you're smart. Gee, sounds like I am. Well, don't take it too seriously. I don't understand what I'm saying half the time. That's why I always have to define words for myself. What are you doing up here, Thunderpaw? Who the hell is that? Look at that cutie. Oh, O-M-G. They're too wonderful. I can't even. Tee-hee-hee-hee. That's the best one yet. All right. Are you looking at cute human photos in your on your phone? No! And you're not allowed to look at my browsing history to check! He gambled away the country's social security program in a drunken poker game against Prussian President Klodomir Kitten. Oh my god. I fucking love this game so much. Deep down, you're a softy who looks up cute pictures in his spare time. Shut up and leave me alone! Also, look at that kitty! The kitty's on the desk, it's so adorable! Okay, okay, if it makes you feel better, we'll pause the 45 second timer whenever two or more cats are talking. What if we're asked to sing a duet together? Will that be counted against us? Because in a duet, you're supposed to sing at the same time. Damn it, Kale! Kale with the important questions, I fucking love it. What about barbershop quartets? Will there be any barbershop quartets? Damn it, Rover. Candidates. It sh Why is it not candidates? Why is it not ca in in cat president? Why is it not candidates? You son of a bitch! You've ruined the one good pun you could have had. Candidates. Still glad to see he's being nicer than usual. Yeah, I think. Who shut off the lights? It's, did this debate just turn into a laser light show? Because I am totally down for that. A new challenger approaches. Say hello to the newest and greatest presidential candidate. Oh my god. Banders! You know how much I love cl cl clottery scratchers? Thanks to them, I won 500 million dollars. Could we please just move on to the first question? No! Not unless the question is, how awesome are you, Banders? How awesome are you, Banders? Very awesome. Next question. Yeah, but I'm rich now. I have a fresh perspective. I can see that I was wrong all along. Millionaires like me, don't need higher tax. We need lower tax. We already pay more than our fair share to the government. That is literally the exact opposite of everything you've said for the past nine months, Banders. What the fuck do you think you're doing? Look, I worked hard to get my money. No, you didn't. You won the fucking lottery. I don't have any kind of degree whatsoever. I don't even have a temperature. That's how much I hate degrees. <laughs> They're for a, per a political elite. But I won't sink to his level and make false accusations. No, the accusations I make tonight are 100% true. This is highly irregular. I demand that you stop at once. Hey, you didn't mention me. How much money to give my campaign? You're at the bottom of the contribution list with 425. At least it's better than Tree Fitty. You're an idiot. I can't believe you haven't changed your computer password in all of that time. Wait, you're still using DreamHouse as your password for everything? Or should I say, why I threw his sorry butt to the curve? No. no. I also
also demand the legalization of catnip. It is a disgrace that some cats are arrested for playing with catnip all day long. But catnip has always been legal. Really? No. Oh, hey, everyone, see how quickly I got what I demanded? Vote for Banders. He'll get things done. I mean, I know Banders is a little kooky, but he's still my twin brother. He's been together all my lives, and I love him. In fact, sometimes it seems like he's the only one I can depend on. <laughs> but you need to get over Oreo. Forget about her. Find someone new to love. A kind person who won't break your heart. Someone like... You? Oh, uh, Thunderpaw. What ending did I get? Normal ending. Well, it's normal, I guess. The audience broke in cheers and applause. Everyone seemed happy for Thunderpaw, except for Oreo and Kale. He exceeded his 45 second limit. Does that mean I can exceed my limit? Because I really need more time to explain my policies. On his birthday, I decided to give him a little present. I kissed him, and I asked him to be my cat friend. He's not stupid, so he said yes. We've been dating ever s each other ever since.